Hello. PCCL channel greets you. Here is a projection screen that diffuses white light. It therefore diffuses red, green and blue. It is lit by the sun for example. If I activate a filter, a disc like this, which absorbs the red, we will see it cyan. This filter allows blue and green to pass through. Both give cyan. If I activate another filter, like this one, it will absorb the green, but let the red and blue through. So we see it magenta. And we have a yellow filter, which absorbs blue and lets red and green through. What makes yellow? I can activate two filters. Since this one lets through red and green, and that one lets through red and blue. In both cases red got a pass. This is why we are seeing red. If we activate the filter which absorbs the red, then there, nothing passes. And the part which corresponds to the intersection of the three filters does not diffuse any, does not allow any radiation to pass. No radiation, it's black. Here is the subtractive color model, or, CMY color model. By measuring the rate of each of the filters, I obtain different colors, which will come closer or less to one or the other. Well, that's what the printer does, with its inks. If you have ever changed your printer cartridges, you may have noticed that there is cyan, magenta, yellow and black. Inks work like filters. Colors in painting work like filters. Painting is the subtractive color model. The same goes for dyeing. The screen you are looking at now, uses the additive color model, RGB. Each pixel carrying three color elements, such as phosphors. One red, one green, one blue. For printers, it is cyan magenta yellow. That's it for this video. Thank you.